Hey guys, I miss seeing you, especially those of you that I haven't seen all year. Um, please make sure that when I post a video for you to watch that you definitely watch it because it's going to have really specific instructions on what I want you to do. So you should have already done your bell ringer before you do this assignment. If you haven't, go back and do the bell ringer because that's what it says to do. So you're going to click down here on calculating my GPA. And if you've been an AVID for a while, then you know the drill on this. If you're new, then you don't. But it's really, really easy because this second page down here gives you like some examples of how somebody calculated their GPA. So the second page is examples only. You don't have to fill in anything. The first page, you're going to need to go to Skyward and you're going to use your grades for the second six weeks. Don't use the one that says like third progress or whatever you have right now. I want you to use your grades as they were for the second six weeks. Um, if you need to sub some of these classes, like if you have medical terminology, you can use that for science. Um, if you have a band and in, in down here for another, that's fine. If you have a college class, you probably don't have any grades yet. So just don't include that in here. All right. So college classes with no grades don't include. So go ahead and calculate your GPA. Shouldn't be difficult. Remember, this is for the second six weeks and you should, as far as I know, be able to type right on this form. If for some reason you can't, then just pull up a Google Doc and you can show me what you did on the Google Doc. That's fine. This should take you all of probably five minutes if you've done it before. If you haven't, then definitely go down here and do it. Um, it says complete the GPA form, submit, and then don't forget this, in a private comment, let me know how far off your original estimation was. If you've done the bell ringer, then you know what your original estimation was. If you haven't, then you definitely need to go and get that done. All right, holler at me if you have questions. Generally, I offer a tutorial session, not that you'd need it for AVID, but if you have questions, I try to respond in the email. Miss you guys. Love y'all. Bye.